but we'll see what he does. Stop leaving us in the suspense. Alright, so he's going Mewtwo. Uh, not quite what I was expecting, but we'll see how he does. Probably gonna go to Smashville because it's a comfort pick for everyone, most people. Alright, game one. Mewtwo versus Rosalina, Rayquaza versus Shannon. Ooh. Interesting option. Also a bit of a slow start. It's unex it's expectable though, because Rayquaza is really good at getting some nice damage with up air conversions, and Shannon doesn't want to get hit by those as much as possible. Oh, that was probably meant to be a down air, down tilt, not a forward tilt. That would have been better set up for combos. Ooh. Okay. Shaman's not doing too bad right now. I don't want to... Yeah, you don't want to go that way. Rayquaza's expecting that at any time. Oh my goodness. I don't think Rayquaza can really approach with... Uh, with that down tilt. The down tilt of this game. Uh-oh. Alright, no rage. He's not going to kill Shaman just yet. Oh my goodness. Ooh, just barely getting hit by that up smash. So now it's getting to the point where... Oh. Shaman's still trying to do these trades with Up Smash. I don't think that's the best idea option at the moment. Oh, he's dead. Nice Trump. I know Rage on Shaman is going to be a little bit harder to kill Rosalina, even with her very, very lightweight. It does kill Luma, though. Oh, that's not going to... That's a valiant effort, but that's not going to be a good thing. Oh, my goodness. Oh, Rayquaza is just up airing, ev up smashing almost every option whenever Shaman tries to approach in the air. And it's just safe. Even if we. Oh, he's dead. A little bit charged forward smash. He got both the Rosalina hit and the Luma hit. That's going to be a dead Shaman. What started off as a very even looking game ended up with just regular Rayquaza domination. Alright, so we're going to game two. I would imagine either. um. It's gonna stay at Smashville, and Shaman might switch to DK, or we might see a town and city, and he'll switch to DK. I don't imagine him going Mewtwo again. Yeah, he's going DK. He's going town and city. I missed it. We go to town and city. We did. What are what what did I say about my predictions? Alright, so this is one of DK's worst matchups. So don't expect too much, but at the same time, Rosalina is very light, so she dies to a lot of things DK do does really early. That's the only saving grace in this matchup. And this is pro quite probably the worst part of the matchup where DK's on the ledge. Interesting option there. Oh. Rayquaza opts to do landing attacks instead of just like landing air dodges or safe or uh, not even doing anything, non committal landings. And it seems to work out a lot because it either trades with most of what other people do or it beats it out. Oh my goodness, get him out of there. Jump, jump, get up, kind of obvious because Rayquaza has the timing for the, the down air, the down tilt on your landing get up. The regular get up, just, oh, that's not going to hit. Come on, Oh, what? No landing lag on that. Oh, that's death. Funnily enough, I think... Yeah, I'm pretty sure Rosalina is in Ding Dong percentage now. So if Shaman could just get a grab, that'd be... That'd be a dead Rosalina. Not an easy thing to do, though, unfortunately. Especially with the way Rayquaza plays. Oh my goodness, he got it! He got the light up air into the trap, into the heavy up air. And that was a double two stock by uh, Rayquaza on Shaman, unfortunately. Not unfortunately, because Breezy said if that happens, he'll donate 500 bits. Let's go! <laughs>